Sam was in the park with his family. It was a sunny day and Sam was having a lot of fun. After a long day, Sam went to sleep. When Sam woke up the next morning, he didn't feel very well. His dad asked him what was wrong. Sam said he had a very bad cough. Later that day, Sam's mum took him to visit the doctor. Dr Smith said Sam needed to go to the hospital for some special medicine. Sam was scared about going to the hospital and got quite upset. Sam's mum said that the nice doctors and nurses would make him feel better. When Sam arrived at the hospital, Nurse Karen showed him where his bed was. Sam and his parents unpacked his clothes and toys. Then Sam sat on his bed. Later that day, Sam started talking to a girl who was in the next bed. The girl's name was Sally. She had a very sore leg. Sally could not go into the activity room, so the play staff gave her and Sam some toys to play with. The next day, Dr Ravi and Nurse Karen came to see Sam. Dr Ravi gave Sam some special medicine to make him better. Sam didn't like the taste. Sam got tired and went to sleep. When he woke up, his whole family was around his bed. His dad bought him lots of gifts from the hospital shop. Sam was glad that his mum and dad were able to stay with him during the day. The kind staff also said that Sam's mum or dad could stay with him at night. Nurse Karen came to check if Sam was getting better. She had lots of machines with her. Later that day, Dr Ravi came to see Sam. Sam was very happy because Dr Ravi said he would be going home soon. Sam told Sally the good news. Sally was happy for Sam but also sad. Sally's had to stay in hospital for longer. Her leg still wasn't better. The next day, Sam and his family got ready to go home. Before Sam left, he thanked Dr Ravi and Nurse Karen for making him better. As Sam and his family left, Sam said goodbye to Sally. Sally was still upset because her friend was leaving, but Sam's mum said they would visit Sally the next day. Soon Sally was also better and she went home. Sam and Sally became good friends and played together in the park. They were both very happy that the hospital made them better. The end. The doctor and nurse featured in this story are based on two members of staff in the children's unit, Dr Ravi Jayram and staff nurse Karen Ecklin. All other characters contained within the story are fictional. If you would like to speak to the Trust about any aspect of this book, please contact our Marketing and Communications Officer, Andrew Duggan, whose contact details are shown on the screen now. Mm -hmm.